Hello students, I am Deepankar Bhoomik and you are watching my YouTube channel Interesting Math by Deepankar Bhoomik. So in this class, we will talk about subtraction and addition of the integers using number line. Okay, how we can add and subtract two integers using number line, we will see today. Okay, so let's start it. Okay, so first of all, we will know some rules that what are the rules we can use to add or subtract. Two integers using number line. So what is the first rule? For the first rule is what? Plus means go right side on the number line. So what is the number line? Suppose this is a number line. This is 0, 1, 2, 3. Okay, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. So this is this is positive, positive side. This is 0. That means neutral. And this is negative side. Okay. So plus means you have to think what? Plus means go right side on the number line and which direction is it this one this direction that means you have to go plus means you have to go go right side that means plus means you have to go right side this direction and minus means go left side on the number line minus means what you have to go left side left side means which side this side okay left side and which direction i have shown here which direction this direction that means you have to come this side left side and number three at the time of addition and subtraction always we have to start with zero only whenever we are doing the addition or we are doing the subtraction okay always we have to start from the zero we have to start with only zero okay so these are the three rules okay and first of all you will pause the video to note it down these rules and then we will proceed to our next things now we will have some examples okay so first example i have taken here 5 plus 2 we have to add these two integers okay so what i have to do whenever we are talking about the number line so first of all draw the number line okay suppose this one 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and put here arrow sign okay and here minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, arrow sign. Okay. So, it is compulsory that you should put here arrow sign. Otherwise, if you write only like this, that means this number line has been ended here. Okay. So, don't do this type of simple mistakes. Okay. Always put arrow sign. That means this arrow sign means this number line is continuing. It is not having ending point this arrow sign means okay now what I have to do we have to add 5 and 2 so first of all before 5 which sign is there you can see before side before 5 it is having no sign and no sign means which sign we have to think before a number no sign means we have to think it is positive sign and positive sign means which side we have to go positive sign means right side you have to go for the positive sign okay and i told you always we have to start with zero so from zero we have to start and we have known we have to go right side we have to go this direction towards this direction and how many steps five steps so from zero we have to go right side five steps from zero we have to go right sides five steps so start from zero now try to understand here how i'm making this five steps okay so from zero first step second step third step fourth step fifth step okay now some students used to do like this first second third fourth fifth don't do like this first of all try to uh, understand how to how we are drawing these things that means how we are marking these things so from here first step second step third step fourth step and fifth step okay then after five it is having plus sign plus means again we have to go right sides plus means we have to go right side so right side means from here right now we are in five and from here again we have to go right side and how many steps two steps so from here right side two steps we have to go again so from here one and two steps and right now we are where right now we are in 
7. So that means what? What is the answer? 5 plus 2 is equals to 7. Clear? Now, suppose question number 2. Draw the number line. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, minus 5. Now, some of the students may be confused that I have taken here till 8, but I have taken here till 9, here taken till minus 4, here taken minus 5. So, how far should we take? What is the actual way? It, it depends upon you. Okay? It depends upon you. That means, suppose we are having here minus 5. We are having here minus 5. So, we can take till minus 6 also, till minus 7 also, but we cannot take till minus 4 because we are having here minus 5, no? So, we have to show here minus 5. So, at least till minus 5 we have to draw here. And in positive we are having till 2. So, we can make till 2 also at least. And more than 2 we can make till 3 also, till 4 also, till 5 also as you wish. Okay. So, we have made, made here till 6, okay, because we are having minus 5 here. So, minus, minus means we have to come left side, we have to come left side and uh, how many, how many steps? 5 steps, okay, 5 steps you have to come left side and from where we have to start? We have to start with only 0. So, from 0 we have to come back, that means we have to come left side 5 steps. So, 1 step. 2 step, 3 steps, 4 step, 5th step, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 step, we have made. And right now, we are where? Right now, we are in minus 5. And after minus 5, it is having what? Plus sign. So, plus means now we have to go right side. Plus means what? Plus means what? This direction. Okay. So, now we have to go this direction. And how many steps? Two steps. So from here, we have to go right side two steps. First step and two steps. Now we are where? Now we are we are minus three. That means what? What is the answer? So we can take till here. So what's the answer? Minus five plus two is equals to where we have reached here, minus three. This is the answer. Okay. Now here, minus 5 minus 2. Draw the number line. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Enough. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4. Enough. Now 5. And before 5, no sign means we have to think plus sign. So plus 5 means right side, we have to go 5 steps from 0. So, first step, second step, third step, fourth step, and fifth step. We have started with zero. Okay. So, first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. Five steps we have covered. Now, after five, it is having minus. Minus means we have to come left side. Left side, how many steps? Two steps. So, right now, we are in five. So, from five, we have to come back. That means we have to come left side. Minus means which direction? This direction. So now uh, we have to come left side two steps from our current place. From our current place. So our current place is what? 5. So from 5 we have to come back two steps. 1 and 2. And right now we are in where? We are in 3. So that means what? 5 minus 2 is equals to what? 3. Correct? Now, minus 5 and minus 2, both are negative integers. Okay. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, enough. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, minus 5, minus 6, enough. Okay. Now, minus 5, minus means we have to come left side from 0. How many steps? 5 steps. So from 0, come left side, 5 steps. So first step, second step, 
third step, fourth step, and fifth step. Five steps. Now after minus five, it is again minus. Minus means again we have to come back two steps. Means we again we have to come left side two steps. So let me draw here like this. Minus seven. Okay, so from here, right now we are in minus five. So from here we have to come back two steps. Minus six, then minus seven. Now we are in where? Minus seven. That means minus five minus two is equals to what? Minus seven. So first of all, pause the video to note it down. Then we will have some another type of examples. Now I have taken some another types of examples. Okay. So what I have to do here? So first of all, we have to remove the bracket. First of all, whenever you will have this type of problem, so first work is what? First of all, you have to remove the bracket. So suppose first question. So here you have to remove the bracket. And how to remove the bracket? Just you have to multiply the symbols or multiply the sign only. Okay. So here three as it is, no problem. But after 3 it is plus and then it is minus. So plus and bracket means what? It is bracket means it is multiply. So plus into minus equals to what? Minus then 2. Now we have made it very simply. Now we have to solve it using number line. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. Okay, now first of all, before 3, no symbol that means you have to think plus. So, plus 3. So, plus means which direction? This direction, and we have to start with 0. So, from 0, we have to go right side 3 steps. So, 1, 2, 3. Clear? And right now we are in 3. And then minus 2. That means minus means we have to come back, we have to come left side and how many steps two steps so from three we have to come left side two steps one step two step and right now we are where right now we are one so that means what three minus two is equals to what one okay this one three minus two is equals to one now here same thing we have to do first of all you have to remove the bracket so here before minus 4 which sign is there here which sign is there no sign means you have to think plus so plus means what plus into minus equals to minus 4 now minus into plus equals to minus 3 now we have to solve it using number line 0 1 2 3 4 5 enough minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 minus 5 enough now first of all minus 4 so from 0 we have to come left side because it is having minus so from 0 we have to come left side 4 steps so 1 2 3 4 ok then again minus so again minus means we have to come again left side how many steps 3 steps so make the 3 steps first Minus 6, minus 7, minus 8, minus 9. Okay. Now, from minus 4, we have to come left side. Because after minus 4, it is having minus. That means you have to come left side. How many steps? 3 steps. So, 1, 2, 3. And we are in where? We are in minus 7. That means minus 4, minus 3 is equal to minus 7. This is answer. <coughs> And this one, same thing. First of all, remove all the brackets. So before minus 3, no sign. That means you have to think here it is plus. So plus into minus, minus 3, bracket removed. Minus into plus, minus 4, bracket removed. Plus into minus, minus 2, bracket removed. Now we have to solve it. Draw the number line. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, minus 5, minus 6, minus 7, okay, arrow, now first of all, 
minus 3. So we have to start with what? We have to start with 0 and minus 3. First of all, minus 3. Minus means from 0 we have to come left side. How many steps? 3 steps. So 1, 2, 3 steps. Then after 3 it is having minus sign. So again come left side. How many steps? 4 steps. 1, 2, 3, 4. Again minus. So again we have to come left side. How many steps? 2 steps. Okay. So from here again we have to come back. 2 steps because minus means which direction? This direction again we have to come. 2 steps. So 1, 2. And right now finally we have reached where? Minus 9. So that means minus 3, minus 4, minus 2 is equal to what? Minus 9. Okay. So these are the addition and subtraction of the integers using number line. Okay. And I think already you have known how to add and how to subtract the integers means you are totally clear that how to add and how to subtract using number line okay and in next video we will discuss about the adding uh, sorry the multiplication of the integers using number line so thank you for watching my video